Hey guys, I'm back. Basically what happened was my bandwidth ran out for the month, so I had to wait till the next month to upload. But besides that, welcome to today's match. It is an Ubers match, and he has a dark right, which is fine. It is the 1st of December, so leave a comment below on what you want for Christmas. Something I really, really want is a uh, full score for Mahler's Fifth Symphony. It's probably you know my all-time favorite piece, and I'm really, really hoping that I can get my hands on one. But besides that, you know, Ocarina of Time, setting up rocks, avoiding the dark avoid. Except now, you know, he falls into that void with, and, you know, has a couple bad dreams. So apparently I'm punching myself in my sleep and he is definitely getting a kick out of it because that HP is going up, although it's already at full. So now he's at that surplus and it's going back down to regular. So he's back at regular health now. I'm going to go to Wild Chase and, or Wild Chase. Not wild chase, because it's kind of wild. I mean, it's a scarfed Kyogre, but, you know, it's raining, so there's nothing much about it. Nothing to see, nothing to do, and I have Thunder, so, you know, I'm going to go for Thunder. And surprisingly enough, I almost get super lucky right here. I go for Thunder, and I get the pair of hacks, but he still gets off an attack, which kind of, you know, it's like, uh, whatever. I ends up, the pair of hacks ends up not mattering at all. Because he can't take me out, even with that Dark Pulse. And I end up living on, I think, 52. Yep, 52. And my next Thunder is just going to finish him off with a Wily Chase. And so he is going to go down. And that is perfectly fine because I don't want anyone else to fall asleep after my Ocarina of Time wakes up. But he has a Rayquaza, which is kind of funny because the uh, colors that I put on Kyogre are colors off of Rayquaza so now they're kind of looking alike and I'm just gonna thunder because he's you know he might dragon dance and I figured I want some damage on this uh, Rayquaza so then I can end up extreme speeding with Deoxys or I can get the Parahax and maybe you know if he has Lumberry you know break the Lumberry but then I can just go to my Ferrothorn and deal with the Lumberry and all that kind of stuff but just gonna go to PK and PK here is just gonna go ahead and be like, yo, I'm on house. Come at me, bro. Extreme speed. So because he's on house, he's just gonna take out the Rayquaza and he goes down, which is why I went for Thunder in the first place. I felt like, you know, I wanted to bring him into the range where Arceus would just take him out and, you know, he sends in a Kyogre and I'm fine with that because his is green too because he's matching that Rayquaza like a boss. And I'm going to switch out and just go to my Ocarina of Time because I'm not sure what kind of Kyogre this is. I'm slightly worried about it because if I, if it's Calm Mind, that's trouble. But he goes for Thunder, which it still may be Calm Mind, but it also depends, you know, is there Leftovers? So he switches in, right, and has Leftovers. So it still could be Calm Mind. That's kind of troubling. But... On the good side of things, I mean, I might be able to burn off some turns of sleep and just hit him with a thunder after he starts setting up comm mines. Ooh, that just fell. Anyways, uh, besides that little distraction over there, something falling and I have no idea what it is, he starts setting up comm mines. And I'm hoping I wake up. Unfortunately, still asleep. And I guess, you know, Zelda's lullaby is a little bit too much for this for this Nialga. But hopefully, you know, I wake up soon, go for the thunder, get some nice damage and you know maybe he's not getting too many combines because that's definitely not a good thing there no sir i do not want that many combines set up on me but then again i do have rcs to deal with this as long as i mean the thing's pretty heavy right pretty sure that uh i can do some damage with my uh low kick off of the kabutops as well but that is going to do a ton of damage and finish me off. So, unfortunately, I didn't wake up. So, no thunder. No para. No fun. But I have a right nut. So, you know, my Ocarina of Time goes down, but I have a right nut. So, we are all good. Ice Beam? No. I have Leech Seed. I have Thunder Wave. I have Power Whip. I'm just going to go for Thunder Wave. And then probably either Leech Seed or Power Whip. I'm not going to start setting up spikes on this guy because I just kind of want to take him out. And I'm not really sure how much Power Whip will do at this point. I'm hoping it'll do a lot. But then I also kind of want to seed, you know, lead seed on it. I decided to go for Power Whip. It doesn't miss, which is awesome. And it ends up doing a pretty, pretty nice chunk of damage. I mean, look at that damage. Basically, you know, 75%. And he gets paralyzed. So 
It kind of sucks, but it's fair Thorn Strong with that right nut. He's paralyzed in pleasure. So the right nut is doing a work in this battle. And uh, you know, Power Whip is just going to miss. So it's like, no. Nah. Um, yeah, so the para didn't actually matter because Power Whip missed. I don't get that extra turn. And Hydro Pump takes me out. So that kind of sucks. That really blows. I mean, <laughs> no pun intended. Now, because Kyorg is just going to go ahead and be like, or Kyogre is just going to be like, Arr! oh, Chuck Norris. Oh, shoot. Chuck Norris is up balls. And I'm kind of scared. I mean, Chuck Norris is Chuck Norris. You can't mess with Chuck Norris. He's got Side Strike. And I'm, I believe Side Strike doesn't, you know, affect the specialty side with the Combine. So, you know, leave a comment about that. I'm pretty sure just the fact that killed a Kyogre with Combines means it does purely physical. And that, you know, special defense boosts don't matter. But if I'm wrong, correct me in the comments. Anyways, he sends in Deoxys. And that's not good because he's pretty fast. And he has Thunder, which is going to do a ton of damage because that Deoxys is super overpowered. Uh, well, not overpowered as in like, oh man, that thing is so OP, but he's just like super powerful. But I have Thunder myself, so how about you take a nice little Thunder, that Deoxys? And, you know, so Deoxys is basically you know, just going to get wrecked because of these defenses. Um, his physical defense is about the same as Cleffa's. Whereas he has a special defense of probably a Bonsai, you know, Bonsai. Anyways, so Manaphy, Thunder. I mean, there's nothing else to do. Maybe he thought he was faster. I really don't know what he was thinking here. He might have had like a Scarf Manaphy and he brought the wrong one. Or maybe he thought he would live, but I really don't see why he would bring in Manaphy. I mean, there's no point. He's just going to get wrecked and ends up, you know, Life Orb is going to finish me off. So... He might, you know, he made it just decided, uh, I want my last Pokemon to stay alive and Life Orb to take out the um, Mewtwo. But he has an Arceus. And I'm pretty sure that has extreme speed. So I have no idea what he was thinking. Maybe he clicked the wrong Pokemon. Who knows? But it is the good game because Low Kick is going to do a ton of damage. And so, you know, pretty good match. Wait, what? 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 It's not over. He has brick. What? How did? No. Wait. What? What? That's. Wait. What? <laughs> that makes no sense. But the RCS goes down. So it is still a good game. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, I would encourage you to leave a like rating and check out the playlist as well but that's enough out of me i'm not going to continue rambling i have a rehearsal to go to for the uh concert in a couple weeks so i will see you guys later peace out